Often the most tricky problems you're going to have with the power rule is when you have fractional exponents or negative exponents, but the rule still works exactly the same. So if I want to take the derivative of x to the 3 halves power using the power rule, I multiply by the exponent, in this case I'm multiplying by 3 halves, and then I'm subtracting 1 from the exponent. So 3 halves minus 1, that's minus 2 halves, or x to the 1 half power. If I want to take the derivative of the square root of x, square root, that's another way of saying x to the 1 half power, right? And I just keep using the same rule. I multiply by the exponent, so 1 half x, and then I have to do 1 half minus 1. And this is where I see a lot of mistakes. Um, 1 half minus 1 is negative 1 half. 1 half minus 2 over 2. This last one is especially tricky. I have to multiply by the exponent, so I'm going to multiply by negative 4, and then subtract 1 from the power. And what I see almost everyone do is they'll write minus 3 here, because they're used to doing x to the fourth, and then x to the fourth goes to 4x to the third. But remember, we're always subtracting 1. So minus 4 minus another 1 is x to the minus 5.